Hey guys, and welcome back, man. Here we are. It's Wednesday, and that means it's time for another midweek motivation and advice video, man. Um, today, we're talking about being your true self, being yourself in all situations always, no matter what they are, man. As you guys can tell, surroundings very different man um so i'm still in the process of moving into this place where i'm at now um still very hectic life so this video is probably going to be pretty quick uh, but i thought it important to bring you guys something anyway uh, especially since we missed the saturday update video uh hoping to have an update video for you this saturday in any case right today i wanted to bring you a video about um bucking the social norms that are associated with wearing facades that we are taught to wear uh throughout our lives from children all the way up right so you got to be this this person when you're at your job. You have to be this person in your interpersonal communication. You have to be this person at a party where you're meeting new people. You have to be so on and so forth. We all tend to wear different masks at different times of day. Um, and I was guilty of that for many, many years, up until about four years ago when I went on this interpersonal journey to find out who I really was, man. And then later that led to the um, weight loss and all of that. And what I found was there's a ton of great power behind um, finding yourself, having that self-confidence to be you all the time in any social situation you find yourself in, no matter what. I absolutely refuse to wear masks. I refuse to lie. I refuse to um, omit information. Um, I refuse to play the games that we were taught to play. And the reasons I do that is because I found that when you do that, when you buck that social norm, while that first reaction of people may be to, to take a step back, um, to regard you with caution, um, what I find is over time, people really tend to gravitate towards that uh, ability to be a genuine person, right? That ability that they see in your eyes and that confidence that they see in your eyes and that you portray uh, with um, being yourself at all times, right? That ability to stand there in the face of, I know what I should be doing here right now, but I'm going to do this thing anyway because um, I'm confident enough in myself and in my social presence and in my um, knowledge base to do the things I need to do to um, show you that I'm competent at all levels of where I should be, right? Um, and I'm so confident in that ability that um, I can just be me without a mask, without a filter, without those things, right? Um, I find people really, really gravitate towards that um, uh, genuine um, personality, right? And I, I, I encourage all of you to start playing with these ideas, right? Um, you know who you are at your core, man, right? You are that person that you are uh, day in and day out with your family, uh, when you're at home, when you're relaxed, and that person, you can be that person all the time. You don't have to be uptight. You don't have to do these certain things. You don't have to wear the mask that society tells you you have to wear. You just have to have that, cons that uh, confidence and that presence of mind to be able to portray yourself in all situations and be confident that you are an amazing person and that you are a person worth knowing and that you are a person that once people get to know you will truly uh, gravitate towards, right? Um, because they do, man. And I know it's scary. It's scary at first to buck the social norms. I'm telling you, there's great power in it, right? When I started doing this thing, uh, I found that um, immediately in all areas of my life, everything improved, right? Um, when I went on interviews, right, I got better responses. People treated me better, right? I got better job interviews. I got better job offers. I got more money, um, more responsibility, right? Interpersonal communications improved vastly, right? More friends, um, better social groups, um, over overall better attention from everybody as a whole, right? Um, because people are drawn to people that can portray that level of confidence and that self-awareness, right? And if you do that, if you are who you are genuinely all the time, then you never have to worry about, oh no, how does this person perceive me? And did I put that face forward for them the last time? How can I keep up with that facade I'm putting on? You never have to worry about any of those things. It removes a lot of the societal, um, uh, intersocial anxiety that that can come, right? Because you don't have to pretend anymore. You can just be you. And I promise you, you are worth knowing and people will gravitate towards that. Anyway, guys, that's it for today, man. Like and subscribe. Leave me some comments, man. Let me know what's going on with you guys. And as always, thanks again for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.